<sighs> hey everyone, Clay's here from Dungeons and Javas, helping you stay up to level up. Today's Friday, and I thought we would jump into the FNM at Home Artisan event, play some knights that I put together, and see how it does. So we're going to jump right in here and see if we can complete the events and how the gameplay goes. Mostly this deck's just about small cheap creatures and some removal, some burn, some instant speed kills, that sort of thing. Nothing special because everything does have to be commons or uncommon, so... Well, if I've learned anything, it is don't trust my first two draws to try and get a white mana. So I'm actually going to mulligan that. And that seems much better. Let's get rid of the tactician here. And we'll go ahead and come out swinging here with the 2-1. Hope they don't have removal on the first turn. Well, we can't get our inspired veteran, so we can go ahead and get a first striker. And we'll swing him in, see if he blocks, and I'll be able to move the counter over to my first striker. I did want to play a creature there in case he had some sort of removal. That way, uh, at least I get the bonus of the plus one, plus one counter rather than putting in the Windscarred Crag Tapped. I like to stay relatively aggressive when I'm playing a deck like this. Keep the pressure on. Swing even if it means trading. And hopefully my creatures can outlast theirs. I sure would like to have that red now though. I don't think they're going to trade here, so we'll see. Oh, my bad. It's got first strike. Forgot about that. There's the fight. And now I get my red. So we'll go ahead and go with red, white. And we'll hold that back as an instant in case he puts a counter on that. I can respond and kill it and make him waste the mana. Or if he's got another rabid bite, I can make him waste that spell. Just like that. Oh, that is pretty decent. So now we'll drop this guy and swing in with the team. I am out of cards now, though, so I'm top decking. that that would be eight damage and then we'll just have <clears throat> so I'll get him down to one here and then I'm guessing they'll only be able to play one creature in which case we'll just swing in with the team and win they did get stuck at three mana though so I don't know if we can really count this as a certified win or not
But there you go. Playing aggressive does have its benefits sometimes, especially when your opponent gets mana screwed. I probably would have been in that same boat had I kept that starting hand, which is the two red mana. Alright, give me something good. I would like to be able to try and build a deck around that. I think it'd be a fun way to win the game. I haven't seen anybody do it in all the standards that I've been playing, all the variations for Friday Night Magic and stuff. Never seen anybody make that work yet. I'm sure somebody out there has probably made it work in Commander. Seems to be a lot easier win con in Commander. Wow, two straight games where I've gone first. That may be a record, ladies and gentlemen. Unfortunately, no white, but we'll deal with it. I could drop the 1-1 one, one Death Toucher first turn, but I think I'm going to save him for the card draw. So I'll just drop the Caves first turn and see what my next draw brings me. Oh, but I'm winning. 21 to 20. <clears throat> well, nothing too sexy on turn two either. We'll do that. I mean, yeah, I could have played one of these and got ready for a heartless act, but... And it worked out the same anyway. Let me go ahead and take him out before he gains any life. <clears throat> so had I dropped the Death Touch or turn one, I could have died him down to possibly 18 at this point. Okie doke. Well, we don't want him to search up any lands. So I guess we'll go ahead and just burn him away. Still not going to play the knight. Maybe I should have at this point. I have him down to 17. Well, I could remove the counters from it, and it would be the same as killing it. But I'm not going to waste that just yet. All right. <clears throat> Let's draw my card, see if it was worth it. Not exactly sure what we're dealing with here. Don't suppose you're going to target me. It's target player. Target me. Oh, that's selfish. Okie doke. Well, I guess we'll go ahead and drop this out. Might as well rim rock him. the uh, level 2 of that saga will yield me a good card out of their hand. Still no white mana. I'm glad that uh, I'm not drawing too many white cards. Well, double the number or an each creature. Am I going to be able to kill both of them this turn? Yes, with a Joust and a Heartless Act. So, which one of these do I hate worse? What's he got coming up? I think we're going to get rid of this one. And then we will... gonna kill him. Just didn't have first strike. Have 
about we do this. Then we do this. I should have done that in the opposite order. I should have read the cards, but that's all right. That would have been a much different turn there. running out of power and he's only going to get bigger here so I may be in trouble this game but hey learn from my mistakes make sure you know what your opponent's die triggers are well see where this takes me just putting my foot on the gas all right so he's got death touch so I'm gonna go ahead and remove the counters from that guy And hopefully that was the right move there. Well, that was a good top deck. Might be game if it doesn't have removal. All right, despite my mistake, the aggro of the Knights wins another one. Such a huge advantage going first. Twenty gems, I'll take it. All right, well, I think we'll call it a day for this video. I'm gonna probably jump in and try this Tinkerer's Cube draft here a little bit later, so we'll uh, see how that goes. Probably record that and post it as well. As a reminder, you can join our Discord channel and you can post the results of your Friday Night Magic event on Arena. And when you do that, I will send you codes for free goodies on Arena, be it sleeves or additional alternate art cards or some packs, whatever. Until next time, once again, this is Clay with Dungeons & Javas, helping you stay up to level up. Take care.